Okay, so Van's World has updated and has added three new hats to earn. But I'm going to go over the hardest hat to get, which is the Van's Bucket Hat. And in very simple terms here, only to do is finish the area missions for each area. So you click on the mission overview. You can see that there is four different areas. And the reward, the last one here for the Forever Skate Park is the Bucket Hat. And you have to complete each area before it. So right now we're in the Hub World. And you're able to see your missions on the right here. You click on this if it's not open, but as long as you're in the area, then the mission will continue. If you go somewhere else, it will disappear. Or you can check over here as well on the board to see what you need to do. So very simply, most of the time is doing uh, certain moves over and over again, which is very easy. If you don't know how to switch your moves, you want to click on tricks and then you can switch them in and out. And then if you need the money to buy it, then to earn the money to buy those tricks as well. But hopefully that's not needed as often. And then the other thing is there's scavenger hunt. So we're going to do that real quick. And there's one that's a jump the coin box gap, which is this one over here. Here's the gap. So we're just going to do it like this. That's the coin box. And then scavenger hunt. This one's pretty easy. It's just the letters are just a circle. And then I'm going to go ahead and just quickly do the uh, tricks and then see how that goes. All right. If you're wondering how this looks, so we're doing kick flex, heel flips, and pop shove it. So we put them all through in the hot bar here. You can literally just stand still and just spam each one. You know, counts. So we did one there. I think pop it, shove it. Now we do heel flips. Spam this. And there we go. Got the BMX. Now we're going to go ahead and head towards the next zone, which is the park skate park, which is on top left. So it should be over here. And we'll see what to do. I actually don't know what to do <laughs> until we get there. Huh? So it's like a nice arrow here to tell us where we need to go. So we'll go ahead, follow the arrow. See where it wants us to go real quick. Oh my God, that's unfortunate. All right, just over here, you can see the sign already. So let's see what we need to do. Hopefully nothing too complicated, hopefully nothing we have to buy, but I think we should be fine for the most part. Claim my B, I claim my BM, BMX. Oh, I see. So we might be using our bike now. Got our BMX, got the badge for that. Okay, so we need to do 45 tabletops, jump the stairs, collect 30 coins in the zone. 40 toboggans, 40 pop shovets, find the van letters, travel 10k, do 31 melon grabs, do 25 bar spins, have 90s airtime. Ah, interesting. That is a lot to deal with. The question is, how do I do, do these? So let's see. Bar spin. Okay, so bar spin. We have that. Quick can tabletop. Is that all one? Did we miss anything? Pop it, shove it. Where is the pop it, shove it though? Oh, we have to click on this. Oh, we have to use these currency. I see. To get the tricks. Which means. Let's see if I can shove it. I think that's on the skateboard, I think. Let's see. Pop shove it. Yeah, so we use skateboard still as well. Do for it to work. And melon grabs, which is another gun. So I'm gonna work on this real quick. I guess we'll do I guess the scavenger hunt. So we got the S here. What else we got the uh, stuff? Mm, I don't know. I guess it's in the skate park. Do the jump. There it is. There's a letter here. And N. If I can actually jump this. Okay, I hate, I hate when this happens. N here, and I see an A over here. Be spamming this a little more often. There's an A, and then we're missing one more. 
don't know where it is. I'm gonna be honest with you. I have no idea where it is. Let me find it. Ah, there it is in the corner, of course. So if you're looking for uh, airtime, uh, you can do this ramp here. You just do this back and forth. Not what you can do, you can do tricks as well. Shove it. And just keep doing this until you get it done. But you should get it done automatically. You don't have to worry about it. And travel 10k as well. You don't need to worry about that as well. So we're gonna I wanna work on these, the rest of these, which would take a bit of time, but I'm gonna work on these real quick. Okay, just finishing up our quest here. We get the manual. So now we have to go ahead and head to the next area. My, from my experience right now. Um, yeah, not to really worry about, um, what do you call it, the traveling and the airtime, you get that done automatically as long as you're moving. I mean, you pick up the coins as well, you pick up these coins out here, 30, takes a bit of time, but to make sure you're spamming all of the tricks for your bike and the skateboard, so we'll take a look <laughs> and see what we need to do for this one here, curious to see how much harder this one is. All right, so we can do manuals now. That's what we unlocked. So let's see, we we'll do 120 airtime, which is should be pretty easy. There's a, a I don't know what you call those, but you can jump off that. Bar spins, which is this one here. Bar spin, grind red beams. So this one, I'm assuming. Find the letters, collect 40 coins in this zone. So make sure you're collecting coins while you're playing. Impossibles, indie grabs, melon grabs, pop shove it, treble 12k should be automatic. And then stale fish grabs and tail fish grabs. Okay, let's find the letters. So we have a letter here and N. I don't, I'm too scared to grind these, I never hit them. So it saves me time. An N here, and then there's one other one up there as well. We have an S down here. There it is. And then we have a letter, let's say about, like I said, one up there as well. We're missing one more. Can we go outside as well? Possibly, unless... I have no idea. There's a V. Can we go outside as well? Or is it just inside here? Uh, there it is. It is outside. There you go. So there's a four. Um, I need to double check. Oh my god. I hate the bike so much already. This should be the red beam, right? Just gotta not miss the jump. Try again here. This should be good. Here we go. There we go. That's red beam. Um, which is our Metal Gear. I don't think the enemy needs to buy. I mean, you might have to buy some of these tricks. So let me look. So impossible is you might have to buy. It's impossible is is a epic which is needed. And then uh, you need to have indie grabs. I don't think, I think that one's fine. Indie grab, which is this one here, indie. And then we need to get melon grabs again, pop a shove it, stale fish grabs and tail grabs. So stale fish should be just a regular one. Stale fish is this one here. And I need the other one, which is tail grabs which is uh this one right here much my that one might cost money as well so you might have to buy impossible and buy that so um yeah but, uh, we'll, we'll work i'm gonna work on these real quick and just finish this i guess all right just finishing up uh, this area the garage area uh, most of the tricks are on the skateboard the last trick is on the uh, the bike here i mainly stayed outside here um coin so i went on like a circle going for here and here and, and all that stuff so now we're going to head towards the last mission area which is at the pvd forever skate park which is 
literally next to spawn. So I'm gonna go ahead and reset here real quick. It was like a noob because it's uh, buggy, I guess. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go ahead and head over here and see what we need to do. Take a look if there's anything we need to buy or anything. Hopefully not because I am poor. I have zero coins. Hopefully it's nothing too bad. It seems to be pretty simple most of the time from experience. That's a huge list of stuff. All right, so here's the last one for the bucket hat. 150 airtime, easy. Grind 50 rails. Uh, I think that requires some effort. Uh, bar spins as a bike. Drop off the big jump, which is somewhere. I don't know yet. Find it. Uh, BMX backflips. All right, so BMX backflips looks like it is going to be Probably a trick we need to buy, but good thing we have the currency to buy it. So let's go here. So I'm assuming this is the backflip, which costs seven, which you should have by now from doing the tricks. So backflip unlocked. Uh, bar spins, we need that bar spins as well. Go ahead and do that bar spin. And then we need 35 coins. Heel flips is skateboard, vans letters, impossible skateboard, no foot can cans. I'm assuming that is a that is a bike one. 15k. Uh tail whips is a bike, not bike, it's 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 it's, it's, it's a skateboard. Toboggans is the bike, I think it is. Uh tuck no hands. Tuck no hands is I guess the no hander, which is this one, cost two. And then we have Vario Kickflips, which I'm assuming that is going to be the uh, skateboard, which it's going to cost me something. I probably bet Vario Kickflips. Uh, they might cost something, probably. All right, so it looks pretty, it looks pretty easy to do. Uh, nothing too, too complicated. Let's go ahead and get on our bike here. Bike's a bit buggy right now, but uh, I'm curious on how the grinding rails work. Um, where is it again? 50 rails. I think you just keep jumping on it. Yeah, so <coughs> that works, I guess. Excuse me. So you can just keep grinding the same rail over and over again. So I see the big jump, I guess. There's an A right there. It looks like fun to get. So big jump is here. How does this A? Can we just go from here? Yes. So we go from bottom. I'll just cheese it, I guess. Let me do that real quick. Just jump off your bike and then just grab it. Easy. And then we gotta get the other letters, which are there's one on the S over there. How do I get up there? It's a ladder. <laughs> a ladder, they say. Okay. That's one more letter there. We have one more we're missing. It's probably up there or something. I don't know. I'll move it back here. Let me see. Uh, there it is. That's all letters. And then we can do the big jump real quick. And then I'll just farm everything else. Let's see. Jump at the end, and there we go. That's the big jump. And I'm going to do everything else uh, and grind this rest of the stuff, pretty much. Okay, about to finish this area. About to get the hats. Need to finish a couple more hell whips here. There we go, bucket hat, do the badge, and that's it. Took me about maybe like 40, 50 minutes to get this. Let's see if it's worth it or not, up to you. I guess do a little rundown of what I did in this area. Pretty simple. Uh, way fast way to really get this area done is I stayed up here mostly, and you want to use this rail, this grinding rail for mainly everything. If you want to get like the grinding done. So you can do tricks on the thing, and each time you do that, it will pretty much count as a rail grind, and you just like hit the wall right there without moving. And just use a trick to get on here. Another trick. 
and just keep spamming the tricks you need to do and then you get you get two coins every like couple minutes you know it's a trick there and then if you want to get more coins without because you know you just get those two up there on the ramp and just keep spamming the tricks here and there and then just bounce back using a trick and then go do it again you get the, you get you get your air time done you get your travel time done get your tricks done and then that's pretty much it coins respawn um you get the coins up there as well like i said that's pretty much what i did and that's not that bad honestly you don't have to move that much because it's all automatic as soon as you hit the wall you use a trick and you go backwards just make sure you're looking where you need to go and that's pretty much how i did it and there you go the bucket hat is gotten um if you say it's worth it i don't know up to you but uh it's not that bad to do uh, it just takes a bit of time but hopefully you guys enjoy that and uh that's the hat i guess